So this is that bend over chair challenge that people on the internet post where they say that women can do this but men can't. Um, I'm gonna call it out right now and say this is gonna be the fucking easiest thing I've ever done. Foot up against the thing. Yep. And one. one two. Two. Okay. Okay. Head up against the wall. Chair underneath. Pull to chest first. Chest first and then stand up. Okay, so do I, my, does my head have to touch the wall the whole yes. time? Okay. Yes. I mean, all that water. We just did. We just did a workout. So this is my weighted backpack. You're ninety degrees. You're not ninety. Okay. Good. Go. You're the rule judge. <laughs> Go lower. Okay. Go lower. Okay. Yeah, right there. Then you move the chair under. And you lift it up and stand up with it. Come here, Willa. And then one more. Come on. Okay, and then put feet together. Mm -hmm. Feet together. So, but pull it towards it. Yeah, there you go. And now stand up. Oh. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. Oh, it's, my legs are straight up and down, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. God, that's so weird. I can like lift Willy up right now like this. It's like I don't understand why it's that's weird. Hard. It's weird. I hey everyone, Lawrence from Happy KO here. Back with another quick tip. Do you ever get sick of using stock Pro Tools reverb? I don't like using Pro Tools plugins and I avoid using them if I can. In today's lesson, today Lawrence Lopez of Happy KO is going to be demonstrating an alternative to Pro Tools stock plug. So in other words, the question is how, how much am I willing to pay for the discomfort of shitting in a jar? Again, reverb. We're gonna be using actually a much simpler setup. Just a guitar pedal, a reverb guitar pedal. This one is called Verbzilla from Line 6 and they have given us the okay to use, use their actual name and their pedal in this video and they're paying us for advertising. We're getting um, sponsored by them and so uh, thank you, Verbzilla, and the people down at Line 6. D Doug, you're a great guy. Um, and uh, thank you to Jim and uh, Katie as well. You guys have been great to let us use your product in our video. Um, so here we go. I'm going to get right to, uh, how to how to do this and what it sounds like. I'll show you, I'll show you a little thing that we made. Basically the setup is real simple. Output, see the, the blue cable there from the back of the interface, goes into the input of the pedal. I'm just using the mono input. On the other side of the pedal, the output comes into left and right guitar cables. Now, now, for those of you who watch Happy KO instructional tutorial informative videos. Educational. You have learned by now why we use two guitar cables when routing our output signal into a recording. And if you haven't learned by now why that is, it means you probably need to watch some of our other videos. So go click on our some of our other videos and watch those first and then come back to this one. Click on those. Yeah. And this isn't this isn't selfless promotion making you watch more of our videos and give us more views. We don't do that on this channel. This is for your own good. And then quality. And quality, then quality first. Quality first, as we always say. Mm -hmm. We've always said that. And also while you're at it, go go ahead and purchase some of our music too while you're at it. <laughs> you need to know this stuff. Purchase it.